Hi, I'm Michael Ironside, and I'm on the set here of the feature film called Eva. I play uh, the antagonist in this film, surprise. Uh, his name's Uncle Alphonse. Um, this is actually my house. It's my palatial mansion that's in disrepair, and I need money. Um, I'm in Romania. You probably know that by now. Uh, I've never worked here before. It's interesting, I've worked in different languages. I've worked in French, uh, Spanish, uh, once, twice in Italian, uh, but, and it gives me a sense of, I know sometimes what the crew is talking about and what's about to happen, but in Romanian, my ear hears it and it sounds familiar, but I have no idea what they're talking about. And it was a bit disconcerting the first couple of days, but it's turned into actually a delight because it's, it's kind of like having this nice, safe spot where I have no idea what's going on and all I have to do is, is concentrate on my acting. Um, what can I say about Alphonse? Uh, I don't know. It's, uh, he's a sexual mollusk. Mol how do I, I can't say it politely. He really doesn't know how to talk to women. <laughs> he, uh, he takes sexual advantage of two of his nieces uh, when they're in their late teens, early 20s. What else? Ah, Amy Hayes, delight to work with. It's her first feature lead. Uh, Maya Morgenstern plays my sister, Maria. Uh, it's an absolute gift to work with her. Uh, she has a way of just sort of plowing through something and taking everybody with her. She's, she's an amazing actress to work with. Uh, Vincent Reagan, um, I know his work, this is the first time working with him. We've only got two scenes together. Um, he seems to be having a pretty good time. Um, I'm kind of pissed Patrick Bergen's coming and I uh, haven't seen him in a few years. We worked together a while back, but I'll be leaving as he gets here. Um, who else? Uh, Emily Hamilton is playing uh, my other niece, uh, the one I take advantage of. She's doing a fabulous job. Uh, she basically has to represent the innocence that gets chewed up in all this politics and money and power and then resurrects herself and escapes through a marriage to an army chaplain. Um, I have a lot of good feelings about this film. It's, the director, uh, Adrian, is uh, passionate, uh, bleeds in this piece of work. Um, the crew uh, is absolutely, uh, what they don't have, some of them in experience, they make up for in, again, in passion and enthusiasm. And we have some amazing uh, key people here, the makeup, their grips, uh, the camera. I've had a delightful time shooting this film. And I say shooting because this is my last day. I'm going home tomorrow. And uh, hope you enjoy.